Day, beautiful kings and queens. My name is Pam Curtis Mancy, founder and president of Pushing the Vision Outreach. Go to my website, www.pushingthevision.org. So today is Wednesday, hump day, baby. Um, tune in today to WFBR 1590 each and every Wednesday to me, your host and producer of Pushing the Vision talk radio where we address issues within ourselves but also the community tune in to wfbr 1590 from two to two to three every wednesday and also to on fridays from stress to success that's the show that i co-host but i also produce that show as well with dr earl t bird pastor peaches and myself this gum in my mouth is so juicy that's kind of rude. I do apologize, y'all. It would never happen again. Maybe until next Wednesday. So, again, um, I'm going to get right into it, as I always say. I'm just going to get right into it because I just want to touch just a little, little bit. Just, just, just a little bit. Just touch on the issue. Just touch on the issue. And the issue is it's you. The issue is you. Let's address spring cleaning in our circle of friends associates churches we go to people we hang around that minister life or death or your friends minister life to you are they planting um planting good seeds into you and vice versa are you the one that's planting seeds into them are you that water for your friend and are your friends water for you if not let's spring clean the rules of spring clean is this everything must go Everything must go. Sometimes we get so used to wearing the same clothes, meaning the same people, going the same places, and don't even realize we cannot fit them anymore. We outgrew the people that we thought we needed to survive. Doubt it. Only person you need to survive is God himself. Get with that. So, we are going to address mind, body, and soul spring cleaning. Spring cleaning will even address the friends that try to push you into their purpose instead of the one that God had for you. Like, for example, hobbies. Stop allowing people to see that you are good at a hobby and try to say that's your purpose. That's why it's good to know who you are and whose you are and hear from God and God alone. Stop being the easy target for, for a profit or a profit life. When people see that you want a word and that you're dying to hear something good, they target you. Toughen up, put on a whole oh my God, guard your heart, and guard your mind. You have to guard your vision. Because the thing is, is that, that it's the vision that God gave you. It may be bold to some or, or impossible to others. Because there is a difference. So, because some of my um, visions are bold. Like, dang, that's bold. But then, to some people, my, some of my visions are impossible. That's impossible. You don't have a master's to do that. But yet, people that have master's call me. Because I'm a radio host and producer. I run Baltimore City only multicultural organization, 501c3. They cater to foster care homelessness. I'm a keynote speaker, not just a panelist. And that's another thing. Stop allowing people to just have you on the panel and when God called you to be a keynote speaker. Stop allowing people to look over you, your leaders in church, a pastor in church. Stop. You have to know who you are and who you are. Speak up for your purpose. Speak up for your purpose. Stop allowing people to have you at the door, directing people to come in. And when God have you asked to be the right hand um, person for the um, pastor or bishop or whatever. Stop being someone's employee. And stop being the one that they come, come to for a job because you are the employer. Spring cleaning is to get rid of every hidden area of your life and address it. First of all, address it. Because some of the people that's in our circle should not even be in our circle. Me personally, my, my spring cleaning will be this. I'm not sitting anymore in anyone's meeting that cannot in, invest into pushing a vision talk radio. Pushing a vision outreach. And anything that that I have my hands in, um, in, in period. Switch up the game. Spring clean. It's worth it. So I want everyone to tune in 
Share this, please. WFBR 1590 AM each and every Wednesday. Tune in to me. Share this video. Like this video. But it's time for us to spring clean mind, body, and soul. And we would definitely address the body as well. Because some of you ladies are allowing people to enter in your body. Not just mentally, but physically enter into your body that's not even worth your space. Not even worth your space, but then you wonder why you deal with self-esteem issues. Because you have given yourself away to so many people and you have nothing left for self. Let's talk about the mind. God in your mind. Protecting your mind. Um, having your mind aligned with God's will over your life. And also your soul. Go on a fast. Just because you can go out with a homegirl that's funny and party does not mean that she is I will say qualified to speak into your life she is not qualified to speak into your life he is not qualified to even take you out let's start purging our you know our surroundings seriously let's do a spring cleaning so that we can get in position for a good harvest that's going to spring forth it is a difference some of y'all looking over y'all garden right now and saying God why isn't this growing? I've been praying for this and he's like, because you still have weeds in your garden, sweetie. And they will not kill what I have for you. Remove the weeds and I will bless you beyond measures. Mind-blowing miracles in the name of Jesus. Unheard of favor in the name of Jesus. So when I tell you, tune in today from 2 to 3 p.m. on WFPR 1592 me, Pam Curtis Massey. Donate to me, Pushing a Vision, Outreach 67676. Baltimore, Maryland, 21215. And I'm looking for a guest um, co-host for the upcoming weeks. I have some great topics and juicy announcements that's uh, bold and may not be possible for some. But when God is before you, who can be against you? And I love it. Correct yourself, address yourself so that you can know how to do a spring cleaning around you. And guess what? Once you do that spring cleaning, you don't, you don't even have to send a text message. Because spring cleaning is all how you move. And now how you address yourself. And what you will and will not allow. And trust and believe the cleaning will do itself. And you will learn how to thirst no more. For good friends, because good friends will be there. Um, donations, donations will start to pour. Because once you do things for God, only what you do for God will last Tune in, WFBR 1590, today from 2 to 3 p.m. I'm your host and producer, Pam Curtis Massey. Look me up, go to my Facebook page, Pam Curtis Massey, Push and Vision Outreach. However you can, donate. I'm good soil. Until next time, and tune in in about 10 minutes, and call in 410-761-1592, 410-761-1592. Or 410-553-06. Two zero. Thank y'all. I I definitely appreciate y'all love and y'all support. Cause last week was a tough week for me, and God said, "I'm not done with you yet. Keep pushing."